We've all had those neighbors in Rust. The ones that uh, once they build up just, just big enough, they start shooting your turrets and walls from their base, camping you every time you come back to base with some loot. They're just there, always, just waiting on top of their roof. They don't seem to have anything better to do. You come back to base, they're always there just waiting to have a, a nice conversation with you. smells like fucking garbage. I'm just not gonna respond. Come here. <laughs> this is Russ. This ain't fifth grade, huh, buddy boy? And when all else fails, they're there to call you out in chat when you're only a solo player trying to make a life. Well, now we got rockets. So now that the opportunity has shown itself, I was pretty excited to get some payback on some of the saltiest neighbors I've ever had. Bro, you can sit still all you want, but I know you don't do anything but rest. So I know you didn't go anywhere. Today was the day. They finally got their compound set up, put some turrets up outside. So it's gonna be a little bit more difficult, but we had to get rid of these guys. And I just did a bunch of coke, so I'm gonna be here for a while. Well, they're gonna be hard to offline. <laughs> all right, guys, I'm running extra monuments today. We have to get scrap. We gotta learn all this uh, stuff that we got last time. We need rockets, we need rocket launcher. I've got it all, we just need to research it, so. Gotta get that scrap. There's somebody outside though. Oh, lag? What? Alright, this is gonna get me pretty close. There's a lot of people around set, so switch to junkyard for now. Now surprisingly all of our bases have survived, kind of making this difficult to keep up with upkeep. I'm not just going to let a base decay. I've got my base above this cave. I've got this cave base and then I've got the one out in the desert. Um, we're going to be hitting them from the one out in the desert. But I've got to get the rockets and stuff from here, which is going to suck actually. Because I've got my uh, tier 3 over here. On. I heard him coming up. I don't know what he's doing in there. He's not recycling. Right when I turn away. Okay. Okay. It's like, it's like you killed a few people. Oh, this guy was loaded, man. I don't, I don't even... I, I, what? I don't... No, uh... I don't want to die coming out of bandit camp. <laughs> I've got over a thousand scrap. I think I can uh, learn full metal now. 1,300. Nice. Alright, last thing is I want to get a shooting floor up here on this base that we're going to be hitting them from. So we need to build that just so that i can see like around if we get countered which we're definitely gonna get countered i hate raiding solo because it's so hard to watch your back while raiding especially if it's a big base so we're probably gonna probably gonna run into some issues but i want to get a shooting floor up here and then we should be um pretty good they're right there they just got the compound all set up too which makes this a little bit more difficult they didn't have that literally this morning but we're gonna we should be fine, as long as we can build in. I don't know. Okay, so I have a lot of extra metal. I don't know how, so we're just, we're just going all metal for this whole whole little addition. This is, by the way, one times vanilla. This is a rustified server, guys. We're not we're not like unmodded or something. This is I'm actually pretty happy about this base. Okay, I thought we'd try our luck with two airdrops. These are the only supply drops I've gotten um, over the white. 
figured I'd toss them out. We got the, the shooting floor all set, so may as well just throw these. See if we get anybody coming by. I mean, I'm just gonna throw them in the compound. I don't think we'll we'll have an issue. But before we go and raid these guys, I don't know how much you know. If if we raid them, I don't know how much I'm gonna do on the server after that. This is my goal, guys. I want to get rid of these damn neighbors, and then I'll, then I'll sleep uh, sleep happily at night. So I had to kind of to kill out, but I'm gonna toss these. We'll see what kind of luck we have with a couple supply drops. Oh, a turret. Dude, I swear to God, I never get anything good out of these, man. Some guys were telling me... Somebody's outside. People are telling me there's like... They get AKs and stuff out of these. Yeah, I've never. Not... No. The best I've ever gotten is a turret. So you guys are lucky. Oh, somebody killed someone. The other one's gonna come down in a sec. Let's see. Take that actually. I need something. Something close range. Oh, nice it is inside. Easy. Alright, well, I don't think we're gonna have a problem. Shotgun trans. <laughs> Wood armor. Hell yeah. See? See what I'm talking about? What? Alright, it's time. Got all the rockets over here. We're set. So, they are asleep, I do believe. Um, I haven't seen any of them around for a bit. I'm not online raiding these guys. I mean, they, they roof camp me every day. <laughs> I don't think it's going to even be even be a possibility for me to online raid them. So, you know, we got we to gotta do what we got to do. And they deserve it, trust me. These guys, complete, total dicks um i'm gonna leave these here for a second i just wanna i don't know if i need to take out a wall or not that's the question really i'm just gonna leave that there for a sec they've got turrets inside the compound now I'm gonna see if i can drain them in some way i don't know if i have to take out a wall to drain the turrets is the question i think i can build in So this is it. They've got external TCs, but I think this side next or near me is gonna be kind of too far away from each other. I think they kind of messed up. Okay, I might be able to just drain this from out here. could raid one of the TCs, but I don't know if I have enough for that, honestly. I'm not going to be able to raid the full base. We can blow off, like, a side. Alright. This would be easier than I thought. <laughs> what are they thinking? I'm actually just going to, I'm gonna go pick those rockets up. I'm going to just strip where hazmat. I'll just try and drain them all, I think, from the slits. If this one's possible, the one on the other side might be too. That might be it. Dude, it's actually damaging the door. It's at 475. <laughs> just from the bullets. Um, I think, I think we did it though. That one's drained now. Two more to go. Okay, they definitely messed up with their TCs here. I can build really close. I'm just gonna go for it. I've watched a little bit, actually a lot of <laughs> Rust YouTube, so I know a little bit about how to get in here. I'm, I hope I can do this. Don't embarrass yourself. First try, we're not, we're not going in with meds. Meds are for the weak, right? And I'm only saying that because I forgot him, and we're going to go for it. I think we should be alright though, it's a pretty good jump. Alright, we're good. So, I just want to see what's going on in here. 
We gotta find a good place to shoot. This is pretty, pretty big, and it's all metal. Okay, so we're in. I destroyed their forges, destroyed their turrets. We've griefed them. Now we have to find a decent place. I've only got enough rockets to blow through uh, a sheet wall and a garage door. So we need to go. We need to pick a good spot. I think this, just judging by like kind of how I saw their base get built, I think this is going to be a good spot. And I think, yeah, we should just... I've got enough on me right now just for the wall. I destroyed the build-up, so hopefully we can't get countered yet. It's kind of a good thing being behind, uh compound at least all right two more two more I haven't heard anybody outside yet either all right last one and there's somebody outside. Well, we're doing it. You kidding me? Turret! Oh, dude. I saw loot though. There were a lot of boxes right there. There were a lot of boxes. Now this is going to be fun because... Oh, I wasn't planning on a turret being there, man. Now we gotta get back in. Alright, there are definitely people there. They're trying to build up. I came from not outside my base. I came from a different direction, so they didn't know where I was coming from. At least for now. There's three of them, though. So what's the plan? <laughs> what's the plan here? Um... We just have to... I guess we gotta get rid of them and try and get back in. Let's see if we can drain that turret. In the building where I, where I built before. There's one up on the far hill. Like, far back. He's dead. He's dead. I think he got him up. Where is that coming from? Oh my god. They got a silence? They gotta bring out the silencer? Really? Ugh. Is that in the water? I don't even know. I have no idea where they're shooting from right there. Okay, so they're draining the turret. I just want to see what's going on. I don't... I'm not gonna roof... Okay. I'm not gonna roof camp, but I do want to see what's happening. We'll kill this guy and go out. They're draining the turret though, so maybe they'll do the work for us. You're gonna peek? Hello? Let's see, uh. What is that? Maybe he died. Nine. He's at nine. 
Yeah, you might not peek. Okay. Now let's... They're down one. They're down one at least. That other guy came back, so they were at three. Alright. I don't want to roof camp, though. That's boring. I'd rather just fight. Let's go out. Let's go out. I'm going to put the bolt away, though. Alright, let's see what's up. They're still draining it. They're still draining it. Still going at it, man. And... Is that a grenade? Well, I think that's the turret, probably. I found the angle. Finally. <laughs> it took him a while. Sorry. You gonna come out? <laughs> no, he's not gonna come out. I don't know if they've actually built out. To be to be fair, sorry, my dog. My girlfriend just got home. My dog's going crazy. I'm sorry. I'm gonna get these guns back to base though. Nice. Guess I got some some back. Just trying to grab extra stuff. Alright. I don't know, guys. I think I have a plan, though. Fuck off. Yo, I'll stop coming back, seriously, though. I just wanted these guys gone. Did I hit a good spot with those rockets? Money on it. Do you uh, do you have any other rockets on? You? Have any other rockets on you? Yes, I do. I, I'm solo. I just wanted these fucking roof campers gone. Seriously. Okay. We'll split it with you if you if you can give us the rockets because we have a launcher. Alright, let me. Uh, I gotta run to my other base. I, yeah, it's not near here. So far, we only hit like. Uh, yeah. Two no, jackhammers we, we can get rid of the other turret cleaning. if you give us the rockets. Okay. Yeah. Oh, uh, yeah sure. Let me go back to my other base. I'm gonna run back with some rockets and I'll toss them to you. I just want these guys gone, honestly. So it's all, all right, yours. Cool. I don't even want any loot. Friendly at the door. All right. Sounds good. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't want anything, guys. Like I have every BP learned. I don't. I don't need anything. I've been grinding solo. <laughs> oh, okay. So you just want to do this base for fun? I just wanted to use my explosives to get rid of these fuckers. Yeah. Oh, dude. Okay. Uh, yeah. I'm down for that, man. All right. You can rebuild your trick outside too, by the way. Okay, sounds good. So, seemed like a pretty good deal to me. I got rid of my neighbors, and I didn't have to spend the whole rest of the night trying to raid that base for loot I didn't really care about. So, it actually turned out pretty good. I gave them the rest of what rockets I had left, and they finished the raid. They pretty much drained the turrets for the rest of the night, and I got to see the neighbor in the morning. Now, I'm not going to lie, this has been the most satisfying ends I've ever had on a server wipe. I... I usually don't raid solo, I mean it's not that fun, you don't get anything out of it, it's just fun to like roam and stuff like that, but to come online and to see this, the neighbor killed by his own shotgun traps, he was insanely salty after this, I will, I'll run the, I'll run what he had to say after it, but it's a little bit different and a little bit of a different tone than um, how we started the video, and he might learn to not mess with solo players so much because sometimes they'll come back for you.